What's up guys? Let's talk about spice. Not food seasoning, just, you know, dusty stuff from space. Now most of us have watched Doom by now and a big thing in that movie was spice. And I recently remembered that spice is also a thing in Star Wars. So today I'm gonna discuss what spice is in the world of Star Wars and what it is in the world of Dune. Take a shot every time I say spice in this video. Now for Star Wars, to avoid any confusion, I'm gonna start with the canon lore first. Now spice here is a type of forbidden substance or substances that is in high demand throughout the galaxy. Why is it forbidden, you may ask? Because it's used for that good shit. Spice can be found on planets like Kessel, Ryloth, and Naboo. And when it is found and mined out, slaves then turn it into a narcotic so that it can be sold. There's many different variants of spice, like Ryo, Carson, and Andrus, Glitter Statements, and Santa Spice. That last one sounds real. I can't really talk about these variants because there's little to no info on them, but I can touch upon Ryle because it has recreational and scientific uses, and Paulston Spice, which is so outlawed that if you just had a little bit, you'd get life in prison. Now let's fast forward a bit and talk about the Pike Syndicate. When Jabba the Hutt passed, his territory was promised to these guys, and they wanted to use Tatooine to expand their spice trading business. But the bounty hunter known as Boba Fett wasn't having it. He whipped it out, did what he does best, and now the spice trading business, as far as we know, is no more. Now in the Star Wars Expanded Universe, or Legends, spice and its origin and how it's used isn't really that different. But there are some things that happened here that didn't happen in canon. The Galactic Empire had control of the circulation of it. When it was found out that some spices could be produced synthetically without the use of natural materials, a lot of organizations went with it, like the Huts. Lando bought out the spice mines of Planet Kessel. But then everything changed when the Yuzang Vong War happened. That is a cool ass name for a war. Because of this war, the spice market was destroyed. However, unlike the canon timeline, it didn't stay destroyed forever. It went back up many years later. And fun little fact, the spice in the 1965 novel of Dune was a heavy influence on the spice in Star Wars. And with that, let's get into the spice of Dune. The spice melange, or simply the spice, is a naturally produced spectrum awareness narcotic. Now, I don't endorse narcotics, but I kind of want to try that. It was the fundamental block of commerce and technological developments in the known universe for a millennia. It also played an important role in cultural developments and space travel. It was needed to guide ships safely through fold space, which is a dimension that allowed ships to move faster than the speed of light. The spice originates on the planet Arrakis, and there's a bit of a process to how it's created. I know it looks like I'm in a booty hole, but stick with me. Sand shrouds, which are the babies of sandworms, would poop into the desert, it would mix in with water in order to form a pre-spice mass. And with the planet's extreme heat, the mass would explode. Sandworms die, Sand shots are released, rinse and repeat. Now it's not hard to believe, but this stuff is valuable. In the days of the Carino Empire, if you had a briefcase of spice, you could buy a whole planet. So you don't have to be freezing and start conquering planets left and right. All you really needed was some special cinnamon. Now let's get into what would happen if someone wanted to consume spice. For starters, their sensory perception might open up. Some individuals may even get the ability known as prescience, which allows them to see into the past, present, and future. Your life expectancy may also be tripled, and you may also get addicted. But if someone were to consume enough of this stuff, you would then get the eyes of a bad. Now anybody who has these eyes may be addicted to spice, but to compensate, their chances of clapping some cheeks have improved. And with that, we are done. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. My socials will be in the description. And please tell me, who has the better spice? Do you prefer Star Wars or Dune? Are you looking forward to the upcoming projects coming out later this year? Are your thoughts? Let me know in the comments.